Did you try to no, fuck right? him, Brock? Yes! I bet he tried to fuck him. Hey guys, welcome back in the vault. With We've Evie. changed our outfit. Look at fucking We Evie. changed Kevin's outfit. We gave him a shitty haircut. Yeah, we'll show you his haircut. We couldn't Boom. get the afro because we would have broke our switch. We couldn't get the afro or we couldn't get the fucking spiked douchebag hair. The so... hardest one and the simplest one. Anyway... <laughs> Uh, all of our whole team's dead, so try not, try, just try, try and get yeah, out of here. That yeah, rat yeah. is oh, running oh, at you. Oh. It's gonna fuck you up! <laughs> yeah, right. you, you gotta get, you gotta get inside. Yeah, yeah. This police officer's gonna say, I need my tea. I need tea! Where's the tea? I'm even thirsty. Tea, tea, tea. Joke's on you, you gotta go left. Fuck you. Alright. Fuck you. Can I we can't... change the tell of Eevee? No. To be fluffier? No. <laughs> I wish. God damn. I wish too. Don't talk to that That's A-Trainer, hot. he'll suck you off. We're here! Oh wow, we're here! Please heal up your half Do we have team. to fight kids again? Yes. In the gym? No. Well... Do we uh, have to? Uh... Maybe. Oh no. I don't really know. I don't really care. <laughs> End the story. Really, I don't really care to fight you, but I'm gonna have to to move on, so... So last week... I'm gonna break your kneecaps. Last week I started off by saying, Hey, I watched this movie, which was, um... Stor stories to Tell in the Dark. So now I'm gonna start this week off by doing something similar. I watched six episodes of Dr. Stone. It was, um, it was a show. There's Brock. All right, fuck Brock. All right. Uh, Dr. Stone was okay. Yeah. Uh, it has my favorite English voice actor as the main character, a.k.a. I don't remember his name. I don't, I rarely remember anyone's name from any Oh, yeah, Dr. Stone's anime, by the way, just so you guys know. Dr. Stone is so an anime. where this is at. Basically, humanity was turned to stone, and then... In the year 5,320 A.D., Brock, hey, I didn't expect to run into you here. I mean, you're standing in front of the door waiting. Keep in touch with all our other... Uh, the girls at this gym turned me away for some reason. Did you try to no, fuck right? him, Brock? Yes! I bet he tried to fuck him. You couldn't see their pussy, so they're like, ah, oh, dude, they can't... I got can't, some candy. You some? got some spiked candy. He was like, give them to the girls in there. They'll, they'll appreciate it. A cup of tea. Okay, so now we can run off and go that way, right? Well, no, you have to go to the gambling arena and, gam and fight Team Rocket. Fight Team Rocket in the gambling arena? What are they <clears throat> doing there? Doesn't that... That causes problems. Hey, hey. I'm gonna be real quick with you. In the original games, you could go into the gambling area and play slot machines. This kid... This game is so kiddified, you can't play the slot machines anymore in this game. Well, yeah. That's illegal. They literally, you, can, you used to be able to, you can't. Your team rocket and Yay, meow. meow. Me ah! This is what they're doing in the corner. And like, yeah, oh, I know. Fucking... They're fucking screaming at meow, beating him over the head with a fucking stick. Wow. Hey. Wow. You know, blast off into space. Oh, well, I want that Snorlax thing. Give me it. You can't. You can't gamble anymore. All right. No, so can't. you see that guy standing in front of that rocket poster? Go suck yeah. his nuts. Hey, anyway, Doctor Stone is humanity was turned into stone. Everyone was stonified. You're fighting this guy now. Um, okay. They were frozen from the current time all the way to 5,200 something BC, aka 3,000 years in the future. Yeah. Um, humanity's fucked. It's all gone. But the scientist kid wakes up. He's like, I gotta fuck some shit. Wakes his best friend up. <laughs> Makes him do all the grunt work. Then they're getting attacked by lions, because. All right. Uh, everything's wilderness now. Um, so they're like, I'm going to wake up this dude that's sleeping. He's the number one toughest guy in our school. He wakes him up. Here's where I start having issues with the story. Not the fact that everyone's been turned to stone and waited 3,000 years to wake up. The fact that this dude wakes up, and as I'm sitting there watching, I'm like, if this dude wakes up and starts swinging at lions, I'm going to lose my shit. Because he's the number one toughest student. He wakes up, punches a lion, and fucking kills it with one punch. What the fuck? And I'm like, now wait a minute. One punch, man. No, Someone shit. woke this guy up from stone, and he stood up swinging, killed a lion with one punch, and went, I'll fucking wear it. Skinned it, wore it, and went, all right. All right, Mr. Thought <laughs> yeah, I know. Then, the whole point, Doctor, or the main guy, is like, we better not wake up. Who do you want to wake up? And his friend's like, I want to wake up my girlfriend. Starts getting chased by lions, they wake him up. But he's like, you better not wake up a murderer, because that would be kind of bad if you woke up a murderer. Wakes up this kid, toughest kid in the thing. He's like, fuck old people. Start smashing old people statues. They're like, they made the okay. world into greed. And then the main character's like, you've killed those people. <laughs> and he goes, nah. 
And then he walks over and went, remember when I said we shouldn't wake up a murderer? And his best friend's like, yeah? He's like, we woke up a murderer. And he's like, oh, fuck. Starts World War II. World War III. I don't fucking know. What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> anyway, um, they wake up his girlfriend. The three of them are like, wow, we got to fuck that guy. And that guy's like, I'll make an army of young people. Then the main character, who's a scientist, and I fucking love him, he's like, he's going to have an army. We'll build robots, and I'll wear a mech. Okay. <laughs> it's like, what? It's like, right now, we're using primitive tools. If I take some sulfur and some of this, I'll make gunpowder, and we can make a fucking gun. Yeah. Either way, there's only six Thanks episodes out. Thanks, Jigglypuff, there. Yeah, no shit. You're going to give this guy tea. Did you go down into the basement? No. Did you just fight that guy? Yeah, I fought Go that guy. back to the fucking thing. I That's the beginning of the story. Care. I'm sorry. I wasn't paying attention. You have to talk about Dr. Stone. Dude, it's a good fucking show. It means is nothing it to anyone. It is. We'll probably watch it. Yeah, I'll end up watching it. Yeah, I'll watch it with you. you I honestly... Funny. It's funny. It's cool. It's scientific. If you want to learn about shit, you won't. It's an anime. Anyway, um, it's weird. What do you mean basement? I'm, Where's I'm this interested. basement at? Oh, it's right here, isn't it? They're you like, gotta touch the wall. Yeah, you gotta touch... I figured, you gotta, yeah. but, you know, I didn't. You ever see how that muck's on the wall? Yeah. Anyway, they're at Primitive Plus... And they want they want to go to space. He wants to go to space. That's his goal. So basically, he even says it. He goes, humanity took like two thousand years to get to where we are now. We're gonna try and do it in a sprint and oh, beyond. Okay. And I'm like, okay. Kid 16, by the way. When the kid was younger, he built a rocket. It blew up in the atmosphere, but he built a rocket to go into the atmosphere. Okay. It's dope. What, the, what a what a dope ass kid. Yeah. They also, the way to wake people up is like bat urine and alcohol. Okay. Yeah. All like right. this bat urine right here? Well, I mean, yeah. So we're gonna wake up, kids. <laughs> all right. That's that's that. And that so then concludes the era of Doctor Stan. Anyway, welcome to the game. What's happening? You went to. We had to fight Team Rocket. We come down here. We suck Giovanni's nuts. You chose the right move to use against a goal that I'm proud of you. And then he vaped in your face. Adam. <laughs> paper asshole. I know. What an asshole. That's two episodes now where I talk about random <laughs> shit. Yeah. But it fills up time and it hopefully. fills up content. I hopefully. Yeah. Hopefully they don't go, God damn. Stop doing Another that. one and then leave. Yeah. <laughs> if they tell us to stop, I'll stop doing it. I'll stop fucking doing it. But I like doing it. It's fun. You know? Yeah, it's, it's all right. It's all right. As long as, you're not, as long as you're not talking for 20 fucking minutes about it. I talk We're for all good. maybe five minutes. Maybe less, because I had to stop and tell you to turn the fuck around. Anyway. Yeah. So welcome to Team Rocket's uh, lair. Here's what they're going to do. Everyone in the room is going to try and fight you. Good. It's fucking annoying. I can tell. Um, you got I don't know. You got to get Giovanni. I would, I would love to be like the little kid and just run up and say, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. And they'd be like, what the fuck, bro? Yeah. Who let this little twerp in here? I like the fact that you beat him in a Pokemon battle and they go, oops, can't continue. Boom. Wait! Oh, you fucking cuck. You ruined my day. I hope it's still there. What? So, right above the attack move, it's yeah. so show you. It's been doing that That's for about Eevee five minutes. That's special now. move. I don't care about it. Kill this coughing. All right, next move. All Shake right. your cock if it's still there. It's Eevee's special move. It's been there move. for about like five minutes now. He like rides God in and God slaps the next Pokemon. That's not a joke. Sweet. Yeah. I have God on my don't. side. Don't fuck with me. I have the power of God and anime on my side. Wait, you ah! God, I don't care about the drug dug trio. You do have God on your side. Anyway, we changed our Eevee's hairstyle. Yeah, to a curly boy. We didn't give a fuck to even try. You know, you shouldn't use God's move on a rat, but you should use God's moves on a rat. We're gonna use God's move on a rat. Eh, no, I don't care. Sure, hit move. <laughs> and he comes in with God. VV Volley. VV Volley. Okay. You suck your cock and you sprint it out of shit. Him. And that rat's dead. All right. <laughs> Like I just, we just like, Evie was standing up like straight that whole fucking yeah, time. Yeah, like moved. ice skated across the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't run at all. Like, it turned you around, kissed from? you on your pee pee, and then sprinted. He was like, mmm. Mm. Like, Ran mm. off. It's like a bad fucking Gmon animation. Anyway, yeah, so that's a white. That, that, that <laughs> one hits. You fucking who cares? It's a rat. <laughs> it's a rat. Bite. That's a really effective move. You shouldn't use it against a rat, but we did. Oh, well. know why? Because we don't care. We don't care. <laughs> Damn right. Congratulations. Man. It's bro. getting hot in this room. It's getting pretty fucking hot in and here. And I'm running out of things to speak about. 
But that's okay, because you just burned the rat to death in front of its owner. Yeah. And you know what? That means something. Yeah, Walmart's pretty cool. I would show a clip of someone burning an actual rat, but I don't want to be banned. <laughs> I don't okay. want to be blacklisted. Uh, I mean, Meowzy would show uh, Was that a... Uh, huh? There's a Pokeball on that desk. Was, a, was that Zoomy at Walmart, dude? You were at Zoomies? I was, I, no, I was at Walmart. Oh, okay. Fucking... A girl. Folding clothes. Oh. And this fucking lady walked up and was like... Fuck me. Do you know all the good prices? And I went, what? And she's like, yeah, do you know any of the good prices? And I went, no. No. And she went, I think someone stole this, though. Oh, what? And I went, what? And she went, I think someone stole this. Handed me this thing called OnePlus. Oh, yeah. You said this story. And I didn't say it. I don't think I said it on the you thing. You haven't said it on the thing. Go ahead and continue. Yeah. I was like, That's fucked up, what the, the fuck? I was like, someone stole this. What do you fucking mean someone stole this? <laughs> I'm just going to do that. But, um... Continue. Basically, I was like, she's like, someone stole this. I was like, one plus, what the fuck? So I started reading the box. It's just a fucking clit vibrator. And I was just sitting there like, all right. Did it have old lady I juices on it? I bet you fucking five bucks she stole that shit and went, someone stole this. I'm going to use this later. Yeah, who the <laughs> fuck walks in and goes, someone stole this? Also, um, while you're telling your cool vibrator story, yeah. that lady you spoke to gave you a Team Rocket set so you can dress up Eevee and yourself as Team Rocket. Holy shit. Dope. It makes you look black. Let's do it. All right. No, yeah, that's a cool Since story. Since we're infiltrating the base, we got to do it, right? Did you use it on her when she gave it to you? I don't know. I was like, I'll show you stealing. No, thing. because oh. she, cause she stole it. I don't know where it is. So. Oh, she actually stole it? Like, oh, she I, just handed you an empty box. All right, we're going to test up Team Rocket since we're in their base. That makes sense. You Maybe know? you can walk past them then. A 12-year-old boy with a cat on its head. You know, <laughs> just cat. walk right on by. The cat also has Dude, the Dude, those shoes thing, don't though. match that outfit at all. What the fuck? All right, switch to Kevin. Kevin. I'm wearing a full black suit. Makes my shoes bright white Kevin, with wear orange. the Team Rocket thing. And I'm I'm sorry to mess up your hair no! so soon. I really like that cap, actually. Yeah. You're it's all right. It. Okay. We don't, we don't wear caps in this bitch. I don't think Evie changed All right, see ya, buddy. Oh, uh, they figured it out. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> How'd you know? He's you're watching 12. me change in the fucking stairwell. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you know? One, you're 12. Two, we all look the same. <laughs> I can tell if you're not looking like me. Three, <laughs> I watched you change two feet to the left of I me. I heard grunting in the <laughs> stairwell. Looked over, he seen your ass changing. <laughs> and then you put a hat on Evie and then took it off and didn't know what oh, to shit. do. Oh shit, what do you use against this? Uh, yes. I do not si don't kick it. Don't kick it, we'll get called don't retarded. Don't kick it, we'll get called retarded. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What are these guys retarded? <laughs> need a psychic move to counter psychic Pokemon. Psychic but yeah, so is effectively good psychic. I was I didn't know. First uh -huh. off, I didn't know Walmart sold that shit. I did. I did not. I bought one. I, I mean, you I bought stole a clip one. Vibrant? I only stole one. I no, left the box. Like, <laughs> I was sitting there and I was like, I didn't even know they 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 even sold those. So she actually handed you just an empty box. Yes, and it stole literally. It, it had the charger it. in it. She stole it. They had the charger she in it, but it. it was like a it was like a you know one of those chargers for phones, old phones. I get what yeah. you're saying. One, I've come across many a things that have been ripped open and just t taken from its packaging. I've never once gone, I should go take hand this to Walmart for you. <laughs> that makes you number one suspicious as fuck, all right? <laughs> if, I, if I was a nine-year-old kid and I took a Lego wrapper, like a, one of those mystery Lego, Lego wrappers, I walked and went, someone stole this. They're going to go, you fucking stole it, you <laughs> fucking idiot. I either leave it there, slide it under the thing for when they, they're sweeping to get it, or I fucking throw it away. I ain't never going to go, oh, this is open and empty. I'm going to walk up to someone and hand it to them and go, someone stole this. They're going to be like, you stole it, you fucking idiot. I'm not, like, it doesn't make you look good in any sense. It makes you look suspicious, number one, all right? Yeah. That's fucking dumb. Anyway. I was sitting there. Oh, okay, also, okay. yeah. Walmart, that was, this is the dumbest shit I've ever oh, seen, okay? Dirty. Guy walks up, yeah. okay? Yeah. And he puts condoms down. Oh, that makes sense. And I scan them. All right. And it goes, is this person 16? Oh. And I went... Are you 16? No, no, no. Like, oh. Or no, wait, this person's 18. Is this person 18? Oh, then did you ask him, are they 18? No. Oh. I pushed fucking yes and moved on. Because oh. I didn't give a shit what age he was. That's against the rules. You better be using fucking condoms. <laughs> no, it's <kidding>. You know <laughs> what? That does make sense. Um, I did. I was like, that's the dumbest shit I've ever seen in my life. You Whoa! Me, you didn't look at the patterns all. You just threw yourself onto a conveyor belt, and I hate you for it. Yeah. But if you follow this path back, you'll get a Pokemon. That's what I'm doing. All right. That was my goal. That was your goal? That was my goal. My goal 
is to get I found a nugget. My goal is to get some puss. My goal. And by that, I mean I don't actually care. <laughs> wow, that was, that was a really cool little thing you did. Thank you. Yeah. You want to watch me do it again? Not really. Because I'll cut it out if you fucking do. <laughs> no, Pokeball! Back! Yeah. Evie's wagging his freaking Kevin, I love you. Kevin's my favorite, dude. Smash the score. If anyone can make some fan press art of me and Kevin. Oh, yeah, press A in that corner. Oh, I was lied to, and I'm going to kill myself. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That's okay. You can get that Pokeball now. Yeah, no. make some fan art, and then uh, send I'll us come. your picture, and we'll hang it on the fridge like you were a 12-year-old child. You are it won't be child. good. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying that now. We, we don't got Game Grumps fans where they fucking make a whole animation for us. I hate you so much. Look what you We're mean. leaving. I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're going downstairs. <laughs> where we're supposed to go? I think so. I really haven't been paying attention. It's fucking hot. I'm also still wearing my work outfit. because You're also still wearing a jacket. I do like wearing my jackets, my bro. My dick's out because of how hot it is. Yeah. Don't look at it. Gotta fan that Your penis. dick's out because of it. Out of my dick's out. Fucking hell. Put your dick away. Can't get away from this shit. I want to fight you. Come here. Alright. I like fighting people. I heard word from upstairs you were coming. How? Who I came want, down here? I want to use my Pokemon to abuse your Pokemon. Let's go. Wow. She looks A-OK -okay for the pound session. She does. And you know what happens? How old are Team Rocket people? <laughs> Probably 12. <laughs> no, they're older than 12. Good. They're 16. <laughs> Shit. I think. Jesse and James are 15 and 16. And Ash is 10. 25? No, Huh? No. You mean 25? <laughs> I need you to shut up. 25 at heart, but 10. No, 10. 10. 10 realistically. <laughs> 25 at heart, though. <laughs> Ash sucks. He <laughs> really does. Ash sucks. Look, it's purple, and it's dead. I like how Ash used the weakest Pokemon in, ever in the world and what? still just beat everyone. Listen, <laughs> I hate the fact. It's one thing. You know, you ever watch that episode where Ash, like, Pikachu gets fucking, like, dead? Or, yeah, dead in the hospital. And Ash is like, they're telling me to evolve you. I don't want to. And sets the, 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 the Thunderstone down to evolve it. Yeah. He's like, it's your choice. And walked out. All right, one. Ash, that's fine. You know what, Ash... Ash likes Pikachu more than Raichu. You don't want to evolve it. That makes sense. Two, Pikachu knows full and well it'd make him eight times stronger. He could kick the shit out of any Pokemon he comes by just by being evolved and getting way better, like, fucking boosts and shit. <laughs> and he turns away from him and walks away. That's dumb. The reason... No. Is because friendship. No. That's... <laughs> I think that's... if I. And the thing is... The beginning of the episode, he starts off by Pikachu fighting a Raichu, and the Raichu beats the shit out of him. Then they're like, we have to involve you, I don't want to involve him, it's a whole conflict, it's a fucking filler. Then Pikachu the goes, mess. no, I can beat him without the Thunderstone and evolving. They fight the Raichu again. I believe the Raichu wins. <laughs> and then they lose, and they go, it's okay as long as you're Pikachu, next episode. <laughs> okay. Fuck it, we're friends. Who cares as about As long as you're Pikachu, it's fine. Ash me. never beat any league. You weak Pikachu shit. He sucks. He gave away his best Pokemon, which was Butterfree. He <laughs> said, go fuck that other girl. I don't need you. <laughs> and I went, all right. I also, <laughs> it like, something about Butterfree changes. Yeah. Um, in the video, in the show, the Butterfree that Ash's Butterfree leaves with is purple. That means it's a male, it's a shiny male. Ash's Butterfree was getting some shiny dick, and it was probably gay. And Jesus. that's fine. It also had an ascot or something. I'm just saying, I think a female Butterfree looks different than a normal Butterfree. But so they changed it? that later on in different generations. Is that true? I believe it's true. Fact check it. I, there it is on screen. Yes or no? Yes or no? There you go. I'm pretty sure that's true. So, I'm fairly certain Ash's Butterfree was gay. And then he was like, I have a good Pokemon, the best of this generation. It's gay, so it's very progressive. I'm going to throw it away. <laughs> That's what he did. All he right. went, get the fuck out of here. Butterfree looked back at him, and Ash went, I'll see you again. We never saw that Butterfree. We might have seen the Butterfree. I think he shows up in one episode later, like 800 years later. And it's like dead. I don't know why Ash is so dumb. <laughs> Ash is fucking dumb. 
So it's Pikachu. <laughs> Pikachu. They're perfect for each other. Dumb. It's like me and Kevin. Remember when there was the first episode with Charmander and that guy was being a dick to it? Yeah. And then left it in the wild and its flame almost went out? That almost died. If its flame goes out, it dies because it's like connected to its heart. Well, yeah. They almost killed a Charmander. What an asshole. No wonder that Char Charizard's such a prick. It almost died. We need to end the episode. We do need to end this episode because it is at 20 minutes, but we'll go for a little bit longer to Grab see what's these going balls, on down dude. here in this world. Oh, you're you're at the final room. This is actually the room to fight Giovanni, or at least who's, who's Gio, 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 yeah. Giovanni is the Team Rocket leader. Whoa. And he's in that room over there to the right. I mean, Meowzy's gonna cut all of that. <laughs> uh, you see the little scaffolding up there? Yeah. You're gonna put Eevee in a vent, and then Eevee's gonna go spy Holy on shit, Giovanni. What a... Yeah, it's really cool. So this is the last battle of this episode. The whole freaking anime. I almost said <laughs> fucking. That would've been bad. The, the whole, whole mess in anime. <laughs> the whole freaking bad anime is just a pile of dog shit. Everything about it's awful. Nothing's good about it. Ash yeah. is 28. I don't. He's in a coma. I'm just gonna shock this bitch. Ash knew it. Broke Misty's bike. Owes her a new bike. Probably could have fucked Misty. Didn't do any of those. <laughs> I was like, oh, what a bummer. Nah, not really. Brock. It's Brock. Got a date. Brock is can't see. Learn from Brock. If you want to get a date, ask every girl you see until one says yes, because eventually someone's gonna say yes. Yeah. If you see a you wanna girl, you want to go on a date. You want to go on a date. Ask you go her on a date? to fuck, and if she says Holy no, shit, no. <laughs> go to her sister and ask the same thing. Her twin sister, and if she says no, go to their other twin sister eight fucking times and ask them all. They'll all say no. Women like and try then, hard. And then go to Hawaii and fuck some uh, cool chick. Yeah. I don't remember her name. Remember, just just. Brock went to Hawaii and in Sun and Moon, Brock gets a date, and it's one of like the gym leaders. It's like the dark skinned gym leader. I don't remember. You guys, not the not the green one that mashes shit up and jerks you off. We're gonna tell you how to Wait, no, don't do that! We gotta end the episode. We'll, do, we'll put Eevee in an event next time. <laughs> Alright? We'll, Eevee, you're going in the event. We'll <laughs> get Eevee next time. Next time. In the vault. Sorry about talking about Pokemon. You know what? It's fucking it's dumb. Fine. It's fucking dumb. You know what? At the end of the day, if you guys want to get puss, all you got to do is ask. If, in the end of the day, there's a rule to where if you kidnap someone, eventually they'll warm up to you and they'll want to fuck you. So just kidnap someone. You just still, I mean. <laughs> yeah, they call us crazy. Yeah, they call us crazy. Shit, at least I hope. Because if you ain't crazy, that means you normal. And if you normal, you lazy and broke.